How to troubleshoot issues while setting up forwarding rules in Freshdesk. Freshdesk Mail Server enables you to forward emails coming into your support email address to Freshdesk as tickets. Setting up forwarding rules is an important step in this process. Here we have used Gmail Inbox as an example to set up forwarding rules. Here are a few common mistakes that can happen while setting up the forwarding rules. Typos while entering the support email address. Typos while entering the long forwarding address. Forgetting to save the changes made under forwarding and POP and IMAP settings in Gmail. This video will show you how to troubleshoot issues caused by these common mistakes. First, let's see how you can avoid typos while adding the support email address. Under email settings, add your company name and support email address. Ensure that there are no additional spaces or special characters in the support email address you added. In the mail server section, choose Use Freshdesk Support Email option. You can find a long forwarding address generated below. Remember that this forwarding address needs to be added under your Gmail, forwarding and POP and IMAP settings. Click Save. You will be taken back to the email settings page where you can find the support email you just added. Click on Verify next to it. Now, let's see how you can add the long forwarding address under the Gmail forwarding and POP and IMAP settings correctly. In the pop-up box, simply click Copy near the long forwarding address to copy it. This action is to ensure that the long forwarding address is copied to your clipboard without any error. Click on Go to Gmail settings. This will take you to the forwarding and POP and IMAP settings in Gmail. Here, click on Add a forwarding address and enter the copied long forwarding address. Once entered, click Next to proceed. A confirmation code will be sent to your help desk. Now, go back to the Freshdesk email settings page and click Next inside the pop-up box. Wait for Freshdesk to automatically read and populate the confirmation code in the pop-up box. Once the confirmation code is received, Click Copy, but do not click Next until you complete the next step. Go to the Gmail, Forwarding and POP and IMAP Settings page and add the confirmation code in the text box and click Verify. Now we will show you a common error you run into when setting up the forwarding rules. If you go back to the Email Settings page, you will see an option to click Next. In case you click on it, you will face the Something Went Wrong error message on the screen. Here is how you can fix this. Go back to the forwarding and POP and IMAP settings in Gmail and check if the forward a copy of the incoming emails option is chosen. If not, choose this option and scroll down to save the changes. Your forwarding rules are now set up successfully in Gmail. Now go back to the email settings page and click on retry. Click next inside the pop-up box to verify and complete the forwarding email setup. And that's how you troubleshoot common issues that occur while setting up forwarding rules in Freshdesk. If you need further assistance, please reach out to support at freshdesk.com.